Meal prep Sunday. Once a week, I cook Gonna up. Gonna make a salad prep today. Got some. I think there's a lot of confusion and a lot of misunderstanding about this. <laughs> meal prep Sunday. Once a week I cook up a lot of food. You know, it's good to stock up the fridge. Then there's no excuses when the food is there. You're likely gonna eat it. When it's not there, you're likely gonna eat something you shouldn't. Gonna make a salad prep today. Got some grilled chicken and some sprouts. Cucumber, whatever veggies you have available, you can put in there. I'm gonna put some garlic salt and some salsa. Sprinkle some of that on. Nice and spicy. I'm getting ready for my workout here. I'm just gonna eat a pre workout meal egg whites and sweet potato, something easy digestible. A few days ago when I was grocery shopping for some egg whites, this was the ones I got. I was talking about trying out something new. I wanted more quality egg white than those from the carton, so I found these egg 24-7 and they actually hand pick their eggs and inspect the farm and everything, so um, since I eat a lot of egg whites and I'm very con conscious about what I put in my body, um, I want to try these out. I'm going to test them. I'm going to let you guys know what I think. And if I like, like them, I'm going to ask them for a discount for you guys that you can get some discount code and you can try them out for yourselves. But I'll test them first. There's another product that I've been testing, this pre-workout from Valhalla Labs, Fenris Fury. Um, I've been trying it out for two weeks now, and I gotta say, I really like it. There's a lot of ingredients that I appreciate. Uh, Acmatine sulfate, arginine, taurine, beta alanine. What these ingredients do is that they go in and they work within the muscle to get you more stamina and that you don't fatigue so fast. I think there's a lot of confusion and a lot of misunderstanding about pre-workout. Some people think that you just gotta be like really amp amped up and feeling jacked and your hair is like up here and you're just like, ah, oh, you know. That means the product has a lot of stimulants, a lot of caffeine, and, and that's just not really a sign of a great pre-workout. A pre-workout is supposed to work within the muscle. You're not supposed you're not supposed to be totally jacked, you know, the, the jacked thing, the amped up, that's the stimulants. So how are you going to use the pre-workout at night and be able to sleep? You can't, so I suggest get a good pre-workout that works within the muscle. And if you feel tired, you know, take a couple of fat burners, that's going to do the trick. Um, I can definitely um, recommend this one, I'm going to try and get you guys a discount code on it. These products that I'm testing out, I'm just testing it for fun. Um, I'm not making money off of it. So if you got a product that you would like me to test and review, send it to me, I'll review it. But I'm honest, if I think it's crap, I'm gonna say it's crap. And if I think it's good, then I think it's good. <laughs> so anyways, I gotta be off to the gym now. I gotta eat quick and I'm out chest today. The last day of Retro Week. I don't know if uh, some of you guys remember the brand Perfetto and the Stripes. This is the Devil's Eyes training.
full blast on the incline presses. You're going to do a cable pull over here. Make sure you open up the elbows and let the elbows kind of float out to the side. Let's go, let's go, Hellie.